The trick to solving compound inequalities is to break the compound inequality apart into two separate little inequalities and solve them individually. What we have here is negative 2 is less than 4x minus 5 and 4x minus 5 is less than or equal to 11. So if we write those out individually, negative 2 is less than 4x minus 5 and 4x minus 5 is less than or equal to 11. Now we can solve these two little inequalities pretty easily. We just add 5 to both sides, plus 5, 5's cancel, negative 2 plus 5 is 3, 3 is less than 4x, divide both sides by 4, and we get 3 quarters is less than x. So x is greater than 3 quarters. Over here, we add 5 to both sides. We get 4x is less than or equal to 16. Divide both sides by 4, and we get x is less than or equal to 4. So x is less than or equal to 4 and greater than 3 quarters. So it doesn't equal 3 quarters, but it comes close. Actually, let's do this in a different color. Let's do that in, say, white. So it's greater than 3 quarters, open circle, but less than or equal to 4, solid circle, and everything in between. So an open circle at 3 quarters, a solid circle at 4, and everything in between. A little easier to see it above there. Okay, and then the other example, we have 3x minus 5 is less than x plus 9, so we'll start there. 3x minus 5 is less than x plus 9, and then x plus 9 is less than or equal to 5x plus 13. So first we'll combine all the x's on the side that starts with the most over here, so on the left, so we'll subtract x from this side and add 5 to this side. That'll give us, subtracting x from both sides gives us 2x is less than, and adding 5 gives us 14. Divide both sides by 2, and we get x is less than 7. And then over here, we have more x's on the right-hand side, so when we subtract x from both sides, we'll also subtract 13 from both sides, and we'll get negative 4 is less than or equal to 4x. Divide both sides by 4, and we get negative 1 is less than or equal to x. So x is greater than or equal to negative 1, but less than 7. So it can be negative 1. Again, let's change colors. Sorry, it's hard to see. It can be negative 1, or it can be anything bigger, up to 7. And it can't quite be 7. It can just butt up against it there. So x is less than 7, and then anything in between. My mouse is running slow there. That's it.